What's up guys, Jay Steve here, and thanks for tuning to Bronx 83. Man, I just got home today, and what a beautiful day today. Eastern Shore, Maryland, we got high of 75 degrees, but it felt like 80. There was people riding bikes, they had the top down. I even took my car for a car wash today. It was nice, but tomorrow it's supposed to rain. So I'm just getting home, I'm gonna jump on the scrubs real quick, put a video into time lapse real fast, and then we're gonna do the Williton furniture set real quick, give you some pointers, give you some tips, show you what they actually look like, and show you why I choose those. Stay tuned for that. Hey guys, thanks for hanging out with me. Whew, it is hot. I think I might have to turn the heat off. I'm telling you, you feel like it's already summer. Well, let's get this review in real quick and get done. So I'm gonna keep it thorough. I'm not gonna go through the whole list. I'm gonna try to put a link below of all the items in here for the Williton set and the Ducal mirror. But let's get to it real quick. So here we go. Turn the camera around real quick. So if you guys are looking, this is the actual bedroom set. Dressing chest, nightstand, queen size sleigh bed, dresser drawer with mirror, new Ducal mirror. Alright guys, let's start off with a bed. So the Wilton bed of choice is a sleigh queen size bed. And be careful when choosing this bed. I, as you see, has low ceiling. And the bed actually measure about at least about 60 inches across. So it was definitely hard if I show you up to get up that narrow stair. We actually have to took the side rails off just to get it up. Actually, I think if I'm not mistaken, we got it through the window. So we had to actually open the windows up and get the bed through the window. So I choose this over the panel bed because I love the beach look of the bed. It's very sturdy panel board and it had that antique look that I like about it. Also, footboard right here shown. Very classical touch. Really like that about the bed. So that was my choice. I was sold on the bed, so I wanted to get a collecting piece. So next, we have the nightstand right here. Still had that marble look up top. Had that double drawer. And what I love about these drawers is, turn the light on so you can see, deep drawers. Love that it was deep drawers. That's what definitely sold me on that one. If you also like the anything you see in my room from the pictures to the lamps, hit me up in the comments and I put a link below. Those are actually the Asher Roth from Lowe's and all the paints and everything else came from the um, Ashley furniture. Next, let me go on this side so you guys can see. Next up, we have the Wilton dressing chest. Now I didn't want a commercial dresser drawer. Or, or a chest of drawers, they call them. I love that whole barn style look with a sliding door. And also have that four, is it five drawer piece. I think one, two, three, four, four drawer piece. And they're a very deep drawer. So anyone knows me, I don't like hanging certain clothes. So what I love is, let me open this up real quick for you. Show you what we got here. Let me go back over here real fast so you can see. So anyone knows me from here, I love stuff. Now it looks clustered, but what you see down the bottom is I have just a couple of jeans that I wear every day, my sweater, and a couple of jewelry right there. Certain things I don't like to hang in the closet because I get that shoulder bumps, so I hate that. So I try to make it as functional as possible. It was deep, came with two shelves, and that's what I love about it. Plus you slide it away, and voila, you're done. But guys, if you do decide to get the dressing chest, be careful because you can't have both open at the same time. Very deep drawers, run very smoothly. So you can pretty much put everything into them. Next up, we have the Duca mirror. I'll put a link on that one. And if you wanna see the full length of this floor accent mirror, let me give you an idea. I'll step back real quick so you guys can see it from right here. There we go. Now I know I have low bearing ceilings, but still, it's a pretty wide mirror. You can see how far it takes up. 
And trust me, I have everything right here in my invoice showing from Ashley's Furniture right here. So if you guys get a chance to pause the video, you probably can see the item numbers right here in each item that I decide. All right, next up we got an entertainment stand. Now this one is sitting in the Vizio TV, which I'll do a review on, but it's a 50 inch. But what I love about this is that I can actually sit up to, I think a 70 inch TV and it's wide enough for you to put your sound bar. It comes with two drawers, as you see down here. And what I love about this is if you look right there where there's glass and that toolbox is, you can put an optional Willetton fireplace. Loved it. Electric fireplace right here. I'm actually going to think about getting that option soon. And I'll put a link for that one as well in the video. And last but not least, we have the dresser drawer with mirror. Perfect size, guys. Sits right there. If you look at it, you see one, two, three, four, five, six. And what I love about it is that the two drawers, I just mainly put your traditional, you know, underwears, Put one for my glasses, for my shirt that I don't want to hang. What I love, if you look at the size of it, they are actually deep drawers. I love deep drawers. I'm sold on deep drawers. So, you know, that's why I choose to get a Wellington set. Now, I know a lot of people probably don't want a lot of white in their room, but I want it to feel like when I come home as a getaway. And that's why I choose a Wellington set. Um, there was a Shea set that I saw um, also, but it's, it's more of a, like a, a dark color and I know dark could be like peaceful, quiet and you know, and you think this is bright, but if it's too bright for you, once you turn the light off and you, you know, get some nice curtains, some blackout curtains, it won't be bad. And actually, let me give you an idea what it looks like when you just turn certain stuff off. So if I turn this lamp on and I turn off this light right here. A nice peaceful looking room. There you go. And like I said, that's the Wilton set. So, number one, we have the Wilton dresser. It's actually a dressing chest. The two nightstands. The Shea bed. Dresser with mirror. And a lovely entertainment stand. And don't forget the Duca Accent Mirror. So guys, if you have any question on this short little video of what my furniture is, I know a lot of people ask me, a couple of my friends came over and they're like, yo, you gotta do a video on your furniture. We love it. Like I said, rewind it, like it, pause the video. I did an invoice showing you that. Um, I'll put the links in the video, taking it directly to the um, Ashley site. And keep in mind that these weren't even showed. The dressing chest was the only thing that was not in the store. They had the chest of drawer in the store. So let me show you the dressing chest one more time. Just because if you visit your local Ashley store, they might not have a dressing chest there. They'll have the chest of drawer there. So let me just give you one more view on this one so you can actually see what it looks like real quick again. So that's again, it's a dressing chest. Just in case the door slides open real quick. Let me show you that one more time. And I'm only showing you this three times in the video only because they did not have a floor model of this one. All right, guys, give it a thumbs up. If you have any question about the accent rug, the paintings and everything else, just let me know. And right here is the Williton set.